De Pasquale back where he finished yesterday's race. Off the second row of the grid, he's made good work of the first lap. A bit of a lock-up into two. Oh, oh, goes Matt Charter. That's a fast oh, pass. Oh, fence. So that's through one, Rusty. He's managed to go off the road there. Look at the What's damage. Okay? Safety car standby. So safety car is on standby. As you wouldn't be surprised to hear that one. That car buried in the gravel trap. So uh, and there they are. There. Yellow flags slowing everybody down. It's a reasonable size hit there for for Charter. Jump inside race control there. Race director Michael Massey to the right of your screen. Craig Baird. There as well, and the bank of monitors giving them access to all sorts of information. We'll get an update on Matt Charter for you very shortly, but just seemed to clip the. I think he was hoping to skirt through the edge there and not hit the barrier. Just clipped it, didn't it, on the at the end of the of, excursion. Not a lot of grip there, unfortunately. So he was uh, not going to be able to get the car turned oh, that. as he would have wanted. His dad's been engineering the car for him this weekend. So we're under safety car conditions here for the second race of the weekend and given the minimal tyres they have to play with for four races over the weekend, this is a little bit of a, a little bit of a breather for the rubber and they can use that. So there he is, uh, third from the back, Matt Charter, the green and white car has a lock up. Big lock up on the left front. It's like he, for me, like he was closing in on Renee Gracie just a little bit too fast. Man, he carried some speed. And had to brake a bit harder than I think he, than what he anticipated potentially. Ran wide very early. Or unless there was some other issue or problem because he was very straight. Well wide of the, where he needed the car to well, be. Oh yeah, but it was the car was very straight. There wasn't a lot of turn. He was obviously just trying to slow it down. So I'm not sure if there was another factor that conspired against him on this one. Hearing that he's out of the car and okay, so we'll we'll verify that for you. So that's good. Small outfit based in Albury. Gets a little bit of help from Brad Jones's team on occasion. In fact, there he is. Okay, so he is getting out. So had a bit of trouble opening the door, I reckon. It's fairly well caved in, so good to see Matt uh, 